Hi you winners, and welcome to a game called Thing in Itself. Now I don't know anything about it, I'll put a link in the description if you guys want to check it out. It is only a couple bucks on Steam, so I figured that's a pretty decent price, especially for something that looks very story driven. I like story driven games. On top of that, just as a warning, I am currently fighting off a caffeine migraine right now because I gave up caffeine a couple days ago. So we'll see how this goes. <laughs> um, begin story. Oh, I forgot. It says Henry and it says Fishbowl when I go over them. Thing in itself is an interactive short story. It is not a game in a traditional sense. It doesn't present challenge to the player and doesn't have a win or lose conditions. Yeah, we hope you enjoy. In your opinion, I might think winning is the best option. Just saying. Prologue. I say that because I hate bad endings if it was because of me. It's so dark here. I can't even see my fingers. Like... We're in a cardboard box. I know. Good thing we're actually in a bed in this spacious room. <laughs> it's not that spacious. But it's bigger than a box, right? I guess. Although, I used to like playing in those when I was little. I imagined I was a princess in my own castle. Did you do anything like that, Teddy? Uh, of course. Of course. I have I options. A box from my mom's fridge. It was a spaceship and a treasure cave, depending on the day. That's very practical. They should do more of those at NASA. Hell yeah. They should. Did you have fun at the party? Yeah, I did. Thanks, Molly. Your friends are great. Wine was great. The Aww. music, though. I'm so sorry about that. Uh, it's not your fault. But I think my ears still bleed a little. I know. I was one song away from a mental breakdown. What I don't get is everybody there heard the same sound, right? From the same freaking air vibrations. If we hated it so much, how come they were so into it? Well, I can see two options. One, we are judgmental assholes. Ouch. Or <laughs> two, have you heard the expression, thing in itself? No. Thing in a what? I don't think so. What's that? It's a philosophical concept by Immanuel Kant. I think it could help us rationalize our shitty moral character, <laughs> which Kant probably didn't intend it for. That one. Tell me about that one. Okay, so... Imagine there is nothing around you, nothing at all, and think of one specific object. I keep thinking about the lamp that went off. My tall lamp? Yeah, why not? I heard the sound so of a lamp you know clip. what it looks like, how big it is, how much it weighs roughly? Yeah. That's what you think. Cool. Guess what? That stuff is completely irrelevant to how it actually is. Okay. Everything in the world, every single object, you see through a prism of who you are. It is your own version of it, not its real self. To you, it seems light, but a child, for instance, would think it's huge, immovable. You think it's brown, but maybe I see it as blue, and, um, Henry here sees it as green. Who's to say who's right? But Henry is a fish. Doesn't he see it in black and white? It's dog silly. Damn it. You see? You think you know something, but you don't understand its true nature. And the essence of any given thing will always be kind of a secret to you, or a thing in itself. Oh. Long story Back. short, the tasteless music you hear is totally shaped by yourself. Oh. Good. good. The good part is that it's nobody's fault. Bad part is that people will never truly understand each other. That is interesting. I'll, I'll go with that one. That was amazing. Seriously, you need to tell me more stuff now. What is the meaning of life? <laughs> I'm here all week and accept major credit cards. I love the way they talk I'm to so each other. I'm tired. I'm going to shut down, okay? You know, Molly. What? I'm really happy we met. Aww. Me too. Thanks again for hanging out with my friends tonight. It was lovely. That is hella cute. Act one. As cats knock stuff oh, over. Oh boy, I forgot that I live in garbage. Molly will come at seven. I should quickly clean up before that. Or okay. before the trash will take over and dissolve my body, which honestly might happen sooner. Okay, so you dropped your fish food. Fish Molly food flakes. Molly wanted Henry to like her and try to feed him. At least she meant well. Well, she's the one that made the mess. I like how everything's 2D. 
But I honestly, I really enjoy this voice acting. Like, they actually feel like they're a couple together. I like it a lot. Can I see the notebook? No. Or sketchbook? No. Textbooks? No. Okay. So let's pick up this wine bottle. We could either get a bottle of that good Chianti or three bottles of this cheap crap. There is something about lousy wine that makes it more fun. Is this empty? Oh, okay. That's what I thought. Books? Book clutter. I've been reading up on German philosophy ever since that conversation with Molly. I should treat those books with more respect. Aww. Pizza boxes. For the whole weekend, we didn't step out of the room and ate nothing but delivered pizza. We live in a wonderful time. You really enjoy your pizza, don't you, buddy? I, I think this is interesting. I'm cleaning up my room. Guys, I have been tricked into cleaning. Ah! Okay, this striped shirt. Molly likes it when I wear this shirt. She says I look like Waldo's sexy cousin. <laughs> I appreciate that. I appreciate it very much. Let's go through here. Or, or not? I thought that'd be our closet. Maybe this is our closet? I think we came home through here. Hang up? That seems weird. Uh, put on the chair? Put on the bed? Oh, I guess drawers. Or wardrobe? Is that a wardrobe? <laughs> this is awkward. A figure it out. To me, whiskey normally tastes like dirt, but when Molly suggested to try it as a body shot, difference is uncanny. Hey, okay, hey, wine. Let's go back in here. We have two. Okay, I was like, he said there were three. Found it. That one still has stuff in it. Well, I guess we're throwing it away. Um, pillow. Put on the bed. Things got out of hand this Sunday. It felt so warm with her under the blankets. Not hot, not stuffy, just warm. Aww. That looks better, doesn't it? Squeaky clean. Oh, Ow. Molly will be over soon. Right click to access cell phone. Molly is calling. Answer. Hey. Hey. I'll let you in in a second. The buzz is broken. Wait. Wait, don't go outside. Sorry, I actually called to say that I don't think I'll make it today. Oh. What's wrong? Yeah, it, it wasn't a very good day, and I think I just need a little space right now. Is everything okay? Um, of course. Would you like to talk about it? No, it's fine, thanks. I'll just take a rain check tonight, okay? Sure. Let me know if I can help you with anything. I will. Thanks for understanding. Hope you have a good night. You too. I swear, woman. Huh. If mm, What does that, that mean? Looks like it's just you and me tonight, buddy. Just you and me, Henry. And you guys. I didn't even get to interact with him. Act two. So how many acts are there? Three? You have one unheard message. Uh, how do, oh, click it. Hi, Ted. I wanted to do the semi-decent thing and talk with you instead of sending a text, but now i kind of glad I got the voicemail. Anyway, I don't think we should see each other anymore. Fuck. I know everybody says that, and that everybody says they know that, but I swear it's nothing you've done. I just can't manage a relationship. I thought I could, but I was wrong. It's just not working out for me. Don't wait for anything. Please, go out, maybe hook up with somebody, or don't. I don't know. Whatever will make you feel better. I like Please the try way to they be okay. were. Why? I loved the what way the they were. Yeah. Semi decent thing. What did she even mean by that? I thought everything was going so well that I need to call her. No. 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 Uh. Oh God. Should I call? No, I should text. Self, I don't want to do any of those things. I especially don't want to be passive aggressive, angry, or begging. Self conscious, maybe? That's. That's not. Okay. I. No. No. We're not. No. Call? Because clearly you want to. Doesn't pick up, doesn't have a voicemail herself. Very convenient. That's okay. No, I don't want to. Do I have to? 
I like how it's now thing in itself. Everything has a different title to it now. Uncomfortable bonk, earthy shit. Henry. Fish prison? Henry! You're not in a fish prison. Mediocre art. Pointless notes. Tedious books. Fish junk food. I didn't even see. I didn't think I was going to be able to interact with it. Bonfire fuel. Stupid board. Wow, you have some, uh... Piles of junk. Waste of time. Dusty lamp. You have some feels. Ugly wardrobe. Tasteless mug. Wow. I have to! I'll do self- Uh, wait, what, so what's angry? Why would you do this? What the hell? Passive aggressive. I suppose you couldn't just be Seriously, an adult and talk to me. Fuck no. This. What am I supposed to do now? Not send I'll that. With somebody. Well, maybe I will. I think I even still have that stupid dating app on my phone somewhere. Maybe I should just go and get wasted on that bottle of earthy shit she likes so much. Wow. Hey, please, let's talk about this. Um, what's this? No. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Ah! Let's say please let's talk about this. Let's see. There's no point in writing again. Oh. Are you really gonna make me start dating someone already? I have an exit. Oversized watch. I... Should I really go out at this hour? Why shouldn't I? What's wrong? Yeah. Should I really go out at this hour? Yes. Fuck it. If I don't get some air now, I don't know what will happen to me. What's gonna happen to you, buddy? Anywhere but here is the achievement I just got unlocked. Act three. I refuse to go out and date someone as a hookup right after we broke up. I mean- I hate waking up to a turn on TV. I don't know why, but it makes you feel guilty. Like you've done something bad or really embarrassing. What have you done? Did you watch porn? Maybe I'm projecting. That is how I feel all the time now. Dude. At least I can switch the TV off. That we re watched old sitcoms. I should feed Henry. At least one of us shouldn't be suffering. Food flakes that she never learned how to open properly. Henry? Buddy? Henry! No! No. Henry! No, 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 damn it. Henry, poor, no. Poor guy. No, 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 no. I should take him to the bathroom and flush him away. Ah! Why? Ah! Could you not? We're drinking that earthy shit. Behind which, which took unbearably long showers. Well, this is very awkward. I'm so sorry, Henry. Bye. You are a great friend. I need to talk with Molly. No! Get over it. Oh, I dropped the food flakes on the floor. Henry. I have two fishies. I love them. One of them keeps coming back to life. But every time I think he's dead, it's so sad. I always make sure now, though. Because I, I really thought he was dead once, and then he just started moving! It was weird. Uh, no. Henry died. I don't know if she's gonna care. I don't think she's gonna care. Sure? Hi. Hi. I'm so sorry. No, she felt... I know how much he meant to you. He was great. He did. Henry was... He was the best. He was wonderful. Are you okay? I love you. What? Ted? I know, I know. You don't want a relationship. You don't want me to get attached. All the standard crap. Well, I did. I'm sorry. I don't know how to respond. 
Uh... Dreams. I don't know what that means. No, n damn it! It must be so hard for you to hear, but I can't force myself to feel another way. I know. I kind of hate myself for this, actually. We had so much fun together. Wouldn't it be nice to have a box to hide and play in right now? Oh, well, well, perfect. Uh, road trip. Sex. Remember our road trip to Virginia. I don't know how you talked me into that, but I have to admit it was awesome. So peaceful and beautiful. Plushie. Do you still have that little plush sheep I won you at the carnival? Of course I do. I called her Marcy and she lives on my bedside table now. Uh, I don't want to talk about the sex. Uh... Wasn't it fun in bed? Remember when you took that robe's waist? Ted, come on. Thank you. Yes, it was pretty fun. Cats. Oh, she actually responded to it, though. Yeah. I will always be grateful for what we had together. For everything. You're such a sweet guy, but... I can't do this. Please try to understand me. I thought you said it's not possible. What is it? To really understand anybody. Oh. That's right. I did. Ted, I am sorry about all this. And about Henry. I know. Thanks. I know you will be okay. And... Ted? Yeah? I don't think we should talk anymore. Yeah. It will be better this way for both of us. Okay. All right. Jesus. All right. I'll hang up now. Hope you feel better soon. Bye. Bye. What the fuck? I can't look away from it. Thing in itself. Dedicated to Tatiana Kachala? Party for introverts. I got the achievement thing in itself. Hey. Cast, by the way, fucking fantastic. I, I really enjoyed that voice acting. Well done. So that was thing in itself. You can do a lot more with it or probably explore in a lot more areas. Um, I just did pretty much the storyline, uh, but I know it can be longer to play. I actually thought that it was going to be longer to play, but it's only been, what, not even 20 minutes? So, there's a cat hair flying around. Um, but Henry, nobody! I wonder if there's something I could have done to kept him al keep him alive, but I don't think so. Um, I think it, this was all about moving on, past a relationship, and to understand how you can't really completely fully understand someone else's viewpoint on something. You can try, you can be empathetic, and I try my best to do that um, because I know we've all been through different things, no matter who you are. In this scenario, he's having a hard time seeing it from her point of view. He had a great time, and she says she's had a great time, but yet she doesn't want a relationship. It's clearly something else going on, um, something that she's probably not full disclosuring, which is fine. That's her choice. Uh, I fully believe that if someone says, like, give them space and stuff, don't get upset at them. Don't try to beg them to take them back or take you back or anything like that. They might, 
but most of the time it won't stay. It won't be most of the time. I'm not saying all the time, but in my experience, it, it's not a relationship that ended up being healthy anyway. Um, it, I mean, from our point of view, his relationship ship seemed completely healthy, but we were seeing it from his side. We didn't see it from hers. I really kind of want to know what's going on with her. But yeah, it's it's okay to let someone go. If they want if they don't want to be in the relationship, trust me, you don't want to be in the relationship either because you don't want to force something that's not good. Um, I know a lot of movies say fight for them and stuff like that, and sometimes you can, but it's okay when you can't. That just means it wasn't right and you will find someone else. It's okay. I don't necessarily think you should go and hook up with someone right away, but that's my pre- personal <laughs> thing. Um, but other people, that's what helps them get through hard times. Uh, but whatever helps you guys, as long as it's safe and as long as you'll be okay, that's what will get you through it. But that was thing in itself. Let me know what you guys thought. This is definitely something to think about and something to have linger in your head. So... Let me know what you guys thought. Again, it's on Steam for not very much, and there are way different ways you can go about it. I decided to try and be as nice as I could, but I think there are probably even better ways I could have gone about it, and definitely worse ways I could have gone about it. So if you guys want to check them out, again, link is in the description to the Steam page. But yeah, that was Thing in Itself. I hope you guys are winning at life, and I'll see you in the next game that I play. So, keep winning, guys. I'm <laughs> sorry.